Hippie versus ZVD, Florida Beatbox Battle 2024, quarterfinal number six. What's up, guys? George DeCloud here. My name is Jorge, aka George. Welcome to the channel and welcome to my life. Um, this is quarterfinal number six. I have seen all the other five before this and even uh, ZD's showcase, in case you're interested in checking that out. It's, uh, you know, on my channel. Just look it up. Uh, and uh, this should be interesting. Hippie from Israel, ZVD from the United States. We have seen Hippie before here against uh, Max O, lost that battle. ZVD, we have not, have we seen? Oh yeah, we saw versus uh, Stan, and who, who won that battle? God, my memories, I think ZVD won, but uh, man, I just have terrible memory, but we're gonna get right into it. This should be interesting. Hippie has kind of a slower, deeper style, whereas ZVD is way quicker, complex, kind of jumpy, kind of, you know, jumps at you with the style. So ooh, I think ZVD would would win this, but who knows? Let's take a look. Get some popcorn, fill up your water, put your headphones on, on, on. And let's go. Ok, on enchaîne tout de suite pour oh, wait, <rire> Ok, on enchaîne tout de suite wait. pour sa battle. Ordinateur. Ordinateur. Oh yeah, so ZVD did win the battle against um, Stan. Ok, c'est un battle de potes là, on est sur un battle de potes. Ok, c'est Hippie qui va commencer. You ok You good You know what's interesting I don't know why, but everyone here seems to be like the exact same height. Every single battle, both opponents looked the same height. I don't know, I just thought that was, like, odd. DVD, ok? Bah voilà, continue. Judges? Ok. Ah, j'aime bien ça, voilà! C'est ça que je veux! Et ça fait! Deux! Big Bang! Let's make this a good one. Okay, okay, the ZVD is about to go in. Um, Hippie's round, it felt like it was divided into two sections. The combos were crazy though. All his different sounds, super crisp, clear to hear. And there was like so much in there, like back to back. I don't even know how that's possible, but you could tell the judges were impressed. The other beatboxers were impressed and it just sounded like quality. So um, I think this was, this was a super, super solid round, like better than average. And 
man, I'm I'm still trying. This that was a fun. I I want to go back and listen to his round again. It was it was tasty. It was juice. Something's cooking. He said, and it 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 sounded like you were you were literally like cooking, like something on the pot. It was like sizzling and 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 things jumping. And okay, let's let's go to ZVD. But it looks like he's he's a, gonna try to take the uh, crowd's attention here. If it's cold, I'ma melt it. Ask the whole crowd if they felt it. Hell yeah. Ask the whole crowd if they felt it. Hell yeah. If it's cold, I'ma melt it. Ask the whole crowd if they felt it. Could this be the best battle so far uh, from the Florida beatbox battle? Out of the six that I've seen, this might be the best one. It's a pretty close match as well. He left some time on the clock, with which I don't think it's uh, very wise to do. You always want to at least close it out. Uh, but he did have a, a strong routine and I hadn't heard it before, but sounds like the crowd did because he was getting, you know, the chance in there for the, for the lines. So I think people had heard it before. I like his range, how he has, you know, a lot of different sounds and they go from, they go from highs to lows. So it's like a, a fuller sound and he's so dynamic with his expressions i think half of it is beatboxing and the other half is your presence i think um even kenny urban said that when he went up against napalm in the uh finals i think it was gbb 2015 finals and he beat napalm to me it, it should have gone to to napalm but i think kenny was a lot more you know, getting the crowd, you know, on his side because of his his presence. And I think that's what ZBD is doing. He's just like really like moving around a lot and, and, and showing. So it makes it look like he's doing more. And maybe he is in part and maybe he's not. But he's selling the performance. It's something hippie kind of didn't do as much he's more laid back more you know it's hippie they all have their different personalities but i think it definitely helps when you're more like in the opponent's face and you're trying to uh, make the crowd believe that what you're doing is better than the other person so i think just based on that i would give this to zvd but technically it, it might have been closer than than the outcome i still think zbd's round was more entertaining um but you know hippie put up a quite a round it, i think this might be my favorite battle so far out of the florida competition but i will give it to hippie i mean to zbd um probably four to one i think that's what the uh voting is going to be like four to one goes to zbd let's see 
Et pour Ribi, s'il vous plaît What a battle, guys Et les doigts en l'air, alors c'est soit on va voir nous quitter hippie, soit rien n'est joué et chacun auront une victoire et une défaite. Attention, et ça fait... Five and oh. JVD passe en demi-finale, s'il vous plaît Un max de bruit pour les, les deux et surtout un max de bruit pour Hippie qui oui. est super loin, super sympa, super mec Allez encore, du bruit, encore, du bruit pour Hippie, s'il vous plaît Encore, 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 encore Et son dernier round était vraiment dingo Vraiment, vraiment Man, it sucks because I feel like Hippie's rounds have been solid. This one and the one... Uh, with the one up against uh, Max O, but it's just the other competitor was better. But uh, you know, Hippie seeing no points on the board for Hippie just feels wrong. Come on, Lago. If I was a judge, and I'm not, prochain battle. If it's cold, I'm a melted. Ask the whole crowd if they felt it. <laughs> All right, first things first, we hit the like, we subscribe. I have a link of the original video. See, let's look at it. This is a great way to look at it without sound. So we're gonna see a little bit of hippies beatboxing. All right, you see hippie beatboxing his his presence all right and now let's see zvd moving around more on stage his hand super quick intense look it's almost like you know how people um say that the way to look uh, like if you're at work and you're not actually doing any work but you want people to believe that you're doing something and to not get bothered is just to seem busy and like you're angry like just walk around fast and be like you, then people are gonna be like oh man this guy's you know don't bother him he's, he's he has a lot of work on his mind as opposed to if you're just like sitting down you know like that also the same concept uh, when you if you want to get in to a place anywhere like expensive you know hotel uh, a restaurant whatever just play the part play like act like you belong there so you just go in and you're like you know you you, you don't you don't go you don't do the like the shyness and stuff like that you you belong there so that's um I don't know if that makes any sense to you guys, but it's what I'm trying to say with ZBD, how he is, he's there like he's meant to be on stage and has a, an appearance that it's like he's already won the battle. So you, you believe it visually, you believe it. So that's what I'm saying. More movement is better in a battle, whatever battle it may be, not necessarily beatboxing, but I think it could be any battle um yeah there you have it guys so the points are up on the board we are seeing now you know more of a of a difference between the beatboxers some without points some with two points so we're getting a, an idea on who's going to be in the finals but we still have to get there so stay tuned for that i will watch all the videos guys hit the like subscribe hit me up on instagram at george the cloud and at the end do a flip till the next thanks for watching